Hello again. Um, this video is actually uncharacteristically uh, soon after the last one, I guess. And uh, there's a reason for that. Um, it's not actually spy gameplay at all. Or there is spy gameplay, but it's mostly Scottish Resistance demo men um, on offense, nonetheless. Um, and yeah, I thought some people might find this interesting. And uh, there is a bit of relevance to Spy at the end, so um, let's get to it. For some reason, you can't see the outlines of my bombs or walls. Uh, it might be something unique to demos, but um, yeah, that's kind of annoying, but we'll get through it. Uh, right now, I have a pipe bottom in every door that I'm just going to explode at the beginning to get rid of any uh, sticky bombs. Um, yeah, so you saw that. I shoot another one just in case there's some outside the door. Protect the Uber. Yeah, um, I do follow this pyro because it's very good to have a teammate. Um, leaving sticky bombs behind me in case I have to retreat for whatever reason. Yeah, um, just putting up a bunch of traps, making sure I'm well established in here. And um, yeah, I do my typical downing stuff, kill that sentry because that's great and everything. I just run in here spamming stickies and just kind of carpeting the area. Um, get two kills and an amazing juggle there. That was, uh, I'm very proud of that. <laughs> but, um, yeah, right now, I'm just kind of carpeting the place with stickies as much as possible. Uh, I back up, because there's a sentry there, and, um, just wait for an opportunity to explode my stickies. Uh, I don't actually kill anybody with that set, but I do do quite a bit of damage to that heavy, I think. Um, keeping them pretty locked down in their spawn right now. And, um, this next part's kind of stupid. I spend, like, 30 seconds trying to kill these two guys, and, uh, don't even get an assist. So, you know, very boring. Uh, I thought at one point that my sticky bombs right here would kill them, but, no, oh, not right there, but I do shoot a few in the corner, and then they don't hit anybody, so. Uh, I was a little confused, but we do get them without losing anybody, I think, and that's great. Um, at this point, I'm just reloading all my stuff, and uh, I'm cleaning up my stickies off to the right, or left, I guess, but uh, back at the beginning. And, um, yeah, I just do the same thing I was doing before, just kind of try to establish um, some kind of, like, I guess, offensive defense, I suppose. Uh, I've got a few nests everywhere. Um, that pyro is trying to shoot those down. Uh, but I can just quickly replace them. There's a, a sentry right there that we don't really want to get out of control, so I do blow it up. And, um, yeah, you know, it's very... It's the same thing over and over, really. Just kind of push forward and uh, layer bombs and wait for people to run over them. Uh, for offensive demo men, or Scottish resistance demo men, at least. Um, this next part coming up, uh, kind of annoying because of the... Uh, sticky jump buff, I guess it is, where you can't stand on them, so I'm kind of, like, trying to dance around my stickies and blow them up and clean them up without blowing myself up. Yeah. Um, at this point, I'm trying to kill that sentry. Uh, do not kill it this first wave for whatever reason, but I do kill it here, and I also snag an NG kill, which is, uh, fantastic. Um, I am trying to, uh, defend those buildings, but they do get kind of mowed over by that uber. Uh, I put a couple down and separate the uh, medic from his heavy, and uh, yeah, see those bombs were helpful. I laid those down before, and now I'm really scared that that heavy's going to kill me. He ignores me for whatever reason, and I just pick up a free kill. Uh, now, this next part I'm going to speed up by like 50%, I think, because it's basically six minutes of the same thing over and over. Um... I'll put up an annotation if you just want to skip straight to the spy part, but really all I'm doing for this um, is I'm putting all my stickies in the same spot, I'm protecting our corner right here, I'm making sure that I'm denying them that uh, building right there, and I'm just kind of trying to push up with my pipes. But um, yeah, Scottish Resistance, uh, it really is an interesting weapon, I think, because um, it's just so different. It takes a lot more thought, I believe. Um, if you've seen Manta stuff, he kind of covers that quite a bit, but, um, yeah, offensive is not really 
the uh, Scottish Resistance strong point. Well, typically, it's not seen as a strong point, but it is kind of interesting because it's not like a um, you're offensive, but you're not offensive by being offensive. If that makes sense, you're kind of maintaining like your push and making sure that they can't advance on you and like push you back so you take on kind of more of an offensive support I would say um, I'm just trying to deny them pushing us back as much as possible but we do end up in a stalemate uh, we don't move past this area at all for another uh, four minutes three minutes five minutes I don't know I can't really see but um, you know I'm being very consistent in what I'm doing I'm shutting off that part over there so that they can't sneak in and get some rockets. I'm um, keeping some stickies on the uh, dispenser so that if somebody sneaks in they can't kill it. Um, yeah, I, I do try to stand on the uh, cart a little bit so it doesn't get pushed back too far, but I do end up dying a few times. Um, Sydney Sleeper was kind of on me this game. Uh, that spy just killed me. He was a demo man before. I did dominate him before, so <laughs> that's kind of funny. Um, I do kill a soldier here. I'm not sure exactly why he walked out onto my sticky bombs twice, but he did. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that was kind of weird, but uh, yeah, there's not really much to it. I mean, I'm just, as I said before, I'm just being very consistent. I'm just trying to deny. I'm defensively denying, which is kind of weird. Um, I can't really do much. Like, I'm not getting a lot of kills and everything. But I think the main reason for that is um, I'm actually keeping them from getting into my kill range, which is... Uh, it's as effective, I think. Um, I'm not giving them a respawn timer, but I am keeping them from pushing us back to a point where we uh, where we really can't like win the game. We're at a position right now where if we do push very well then we uh, will have a win, but if they pushed us back to our other point I don't think we would be able to and I'm keeping them from doing that. So That's really as offensive as the uh, Scottish Resistance is going to get because um, you know your direct combat isn't really that great and if you're gonna go head to head with a Scottish Resistance instead of your pipe bomb launchers, you kind of have to be super, have super predictability. Or no, you have to predict very well and um, just cover places where they're gonna be. Now at this point, I get kind of antsy and uh, I kind of go spy mode, and so I decide that hey, you know what? It's probably a good time for me to go spy. I want to win this game. Um, I am using Ambassador, uh, Invisibility Watch, and Year. Uh, I'm probably going to make a commentary, an actual full-fledged commentary on this later. Um, yeah, but, you know, I'm going to switch into spy commentary here. Uh, I do jump up into the sniper roost, and I do get a very easy backstab on the sniper. And um, out of that, I just chain. It's one big chain, and I end up winning the game. I get something like two and a half destructions um, and ten stabs. It's and we just push without any kind of problem out of that so you know it's kind of one of those examples um, Spy is a great stalemate breaker <laughs> especially since we didn't really have one and they weren't expecting it I do trick that medic and then I stair stab him which is kind of hilarious but um yeah at this point we just completely won we just decimated them they weren't expecting a spy and uh, I was kind of keeping them grouped up in their base as a demo man so I really had great potential for a chain snap and that's exactly what you saw so yeah a good time to change classes and it worked well um, I will be making another again I will be making another uh, spy commentary probably with this loadout it might be slightly different cloak and dagger maybe but yeah expect that soon and uh, now before I say goodbye to you guys I'd like to uh, say happy birthday to my grandma um, it is her 75th birthday, which is, uh, higher than I can count, but, uh, <laughs> yeah, so, uh, I'd like to thank her for just being there, not only for me, but for my entire family for the past 18 and beyond years, so, um, 
thank you and happy birthday.